Hi guys, welcome to ASA Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to remove forgotten BIOS or UEFI password for Windows computers. And also this tutorial will help to reset the hardware configuration if your computer does not boot due to misconfigured BIOS or UEFI settings. Do you know that a password protected BIOS add one more layer of security for our computers? Yes, it is highly important to prevent others from accessing the BIOS or UEFI settings if you want to protect your computers. And this is one of the most possible issues in which you can forget the BIOS password. And then this may be a huge problem for you. However, don't worry, this tutorial explains how to remove BIOS password for a laptop or a desktop computers. So let's get started. As you can see, I forget this laptop's BIOS password. There are several ways to reset or bypass the forgotten BIOS password, but they did not work for this laptop's model. Luckily, we found another method which is 100% working method for many laptops brand including this Acer laptop's model and many desktop computers. Note, before performing this repair with your laptop, please keep in mind that performing this repair at your own risk. However, at first, shut down your PC by pressing the power button. and remove the power adapter cable from laptop's electrical outlet and remove all the external devices from your laptop or your computer including an ethernet cable after that turn your laptop's bottom side up or if you are a desktop user then open the side panel of your computer case now remove the main battery for laptop users note if your laptop's battery is inside your laptop then find a small pinhole at the bottom side of your laptop once you found, insert a paper clip into the hole and gently press for 10 seconds to reset the battery. Now, you need a flip set screwdriver to unscrew all the screws on the bottom panel and do everything very gently. Now, remove the laptop's bottom cover to locate the CMS coin cell battery. Now, remove the main battery. Okay, now looks very carefully both sides of your motherboard to find out the CMS coin cell battery. Generally, the CMS coin cell batteries are smaller than a quarter and it comes with 3 voltages.
well. Once you found, carefully remove the CMS coin cell battery and wait for 10 to 30 minutes. Note, some motherboards are made in such a way that it's necessary to remove the CMS coin cell battery for a long time to reset everything. So basically when the power supply to the CMS chip is disconnected, then the stored information and your personal hardware configuration including BIOS or UEFI password on the CMS chip will be erased and it will automatically reset all the settings to default. After 10 to 30 minutes, reconnect the CMS coin cell battery and reassemble your computer very gently and very carefully. After reassemble, at first, reattach the AC power adapter cable and then turn on the system and be ready to enter your PC's BIOS by pressing the BIOS key to check if everything went well and hopefully your problem will be solved. Alright, as you can see, there's no more asking for the BIOS password again. As you can see, the supervisor password status was cleared. So I hope this method was helpful for you. If you have any question, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.